welcome guys to quick and dirty let's get right to it guys look at this question what kind of question is it where do you go to the question duh right it's getting pretty repetitive hopefully which means you guys probably you know remember act actually actually to do these things when you do the test okay so let's just jump right to the question which finding of true would most directly support the researcher's hypothesis? So what kind of question is this? Support the hypothesis, okay? So my previous video was about probably about supporting hypothesis through data. How is this one different? Because it's on text. Textual evidence for hypothesis. But if you guys want to take notes, it's just support the hypothesis question on the digital SAT. Okay, what do we do with all this text that I, I took such a pain to write? You ignore it, right? Okay, so let's go to the last sentence or two. Because if I want to look up what supports the hypothesis, then I need to know what is the hypothesis. Pretty simple, right? Where is the hypothesis? Right here. In the last sentence or two. Sometimes you have to read the last two sentences. But I see the word hypothesized. That means hypothesis. Okay, so let's look at it here. Based on this observation, the ecologists have hypothesized. There we go that the plants break down the rocks with these enzymes, as this makes the rocks not only easier to burrow through and create room for further growth, but also aids with nitrogen fixation that results in the vital nutrients of nitrates and ammonia. Okay, just based on that, can you guys look at A, B, C, D and try which one you guys might think? Because when I was making this, as you guys know, I make this based off of the Blue Book test. I actually had like a moment. I was like, is this going to be this or that? So I, I had to pause a little bit. So let's see. What do you guys think? As always, I pause myself, even though I don't need to. Okay, so you guys might have been stuck between two answer choices. And I do think in regular life, you could argue for both. But is SAT regular life? No, SAT just SAT. Yeah. So what is my actual answer going to be? I only care about this part. Okay. This part over here, I'm going to be very bold here because I've been living very bold. You know, I broke this wrist with a different story I'm telling everybody, right? I Let's say I fought like, I don't know, 17 people at once. Yeah, no, I didn't, but yeah, I'll leave it a mystery, guys. So look at all this stuff here. I know we've already crossed at all this stuff in the beginning, right? Like, ah, uh, that's out. But you say, oh, then doesn't that mean I have to focus on this? No, because I need to support the hypothesis, right? The only part that's actually the hypothesis is from here to here. All right, okay, it's getting a little bit messy, but my wrist is broken, guys, bear with me. I'm not gonna redo this. I don't care about this stuff. That is there to what? Distract you, kind of hope to make you fail. Does that sound mean? Yes, College Board. I hope you guys are okay with my channel, but you guys are not very nice. Okay. You guys are not. Mm, eh, you guys are nice. Yeah, I say, I'll say, I'll say you're nice. Okay. So that stuff, if you guys are looking at that, you guys might have put C. Let me cross that out for you guys. Okay. So don't get distracted. Let's just focus on exactly, exactly the words. Plants break down the rocks with these enzymes. That's hypothesis. Plants break down rocks with enzymes. Do you know what enzymes are? If you do, great. If you don't, we'll look it up. It's important. Yeah, but not for SAT. They break down rocks with enzymes. Which one says they break down rocks? D. Why is that? Does it use the word break down? No, because as you guys know from probably at least 30 of my videos, you guys have to paraphrase. You guys have to paraphrase. So it said they break down the rocks. Did they say it in the correct answer choice? No, of course not. Because that'd be too easy. That'd be a nice thing to do. Create new pathways through rocks. That is a stupid way to phrase that. I know, because I made that phrase. But they break down rocks can be turned into they create new pathways through rocks. What does that mean? They make holes in the rocks. That's breaking down the rocks. Okay. The rest of it, I don't really care. I don't even care about that at all. So... If I summarize this in actually solving this, it sounds stupidly simple and short. And if I'm doing that, I'm probably on the right track. That's the explanation. So what is it? The hypothesis was they break down rocks. What supports the fact that they break down rocks? They make holes in the rocks. There we go. That's it. So that my answer is D. So to sum up, what do you do? The things that you always do, these things you should know by heart, tattoo it or something. Okay. You do not read the text, right? You read the question. You identify it as support the hypothesis. So what do you do? You find the hypothesis. And then you ignore everything but the hypothesis. All of these things sound like common sense, right? So do the common sense, okay? So notice I crossed out everything else. You can do that on the actual test as well. This would be easier if I had a highlighter, but you don't get a highlighter in the test. So I'm not going to do that. So that's it for finding the evidence to support the hypothesis. A lot of you guys have been asking on various types of supporting the blank questions. So I'm doing a good variety. I think I recently did a table one. I'm doing the text one. If there are other varieties that I've missed, 
leave a comment, right? Or you could even shoot me a DM. That's fine. DMs are fun. If you guys track down my Instagram, it's a, it's a fun place. Yeah, I did like a Korean spa thing recently. I recommend. Oh, spa club, Manhattan. Shout out. Okay. 32nd Street, K-Town, guys. You guys see my, might see my face. Might see my face on the street. Okay. Uh, enough self-promotion. Not really. This whole channel self-promotion. Why? So I can help more of you people because I really actually enjoy doing this. See you guys next week. Oh, yeah. My arm is like this. This will, You guys will see this for, I don't know, next six to eight weeks probably. So get used to it. I don't know. Uh, I'll see you guys next time. Study every day with who? Me, Sexy J, the best way. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.